Today we will be testing the Machine Learning Momentum Index Indicator. Before we do, if you have not watched the first videos on the channel and the videos after that, you need to go do that now. Here at the Academy of Forex, we are building the best trading system possible as a team. You can find a link down below to sign up for TradingView. If you use that link, you'll save a little bit of money on your account. You can also find a link below to join us on Discord. If you are interested in a full list of all the indicators and strategies that we have tested along with their win rates, you can sign up for our Patreon and you will receive a full list of all the indicators and strategies that we have tested. You can find a link to our Patreon down below in the description. We also have a Patreon-only exclusive Discord channel where we will give you a list of winning indicators, a list of winning strategies, post trade ideas, give advanced advice, and much more. So click the link below to join our Patreon. All right, as I said, today we will be testing the Machine Learning Momentum Index Indicator. Before we do, though, I wanted to put the testing scoreboard up for everyone to see. So to date, we have tested a total of 97 different strategies, with 28 of them being winners. The best one so far was able to achieve an 84% win rate. We've also tested a total of 927 indicators with 383 of them being winners. The best one so far was able to achieve a 100% win rate. Now you need to go back and watch those videos to understand the context of how they were able to achieve that. So go back and watch those videos and see what you can get out of those winning indicators. We've also retested in the advanced testing 108 of the winning indicators. 39 of them have been able to maintain the winning status the best to a 76% win rate. Now keep in mind that we test most of these indicators and strategies on the Forex and crypto market, but they can be applied to just about any market and time frame universally. Okay, so today we are testing the Machine Learning Momentum Index Indicator, and this comes from a source video that once again claims that it is an amazing AI um, indicator that um, is the most profitable indicator, most profitable indicator in general, most profitable indicator on TradingView, and so on. We seem to get this quite a bit. Um, there's a lot of people who are currently on this whole the uh, whole AI uh, trend where they um, are finding um, just about any indicator that uh, claims to be machine learning or AI or anything along those lines, the uh, chat GPT, and uh, claim that it's the best of the best and so on. And so, of course, we're going to put those to uh, the test here to see if it actually is the best indicator. And so you can see the machine learning momentum index down here on the bottom of the screen. And so um, what we are looking for is when the blue line here, I'm not sure, well, let's see, it's the prediction line it looks like. Um, looks like both of them are the prediction line, but the MLMI, prediction line, blue line. Uh, when it gets down to the lower part of the indicator, you can see that it gets a shade of red on it here. And you can see when it gets to the top side of the indicator, it gets a shade of green there. And so what we're looking for is when it picks up that shade of red or that shade of green, we're then looking for it to cross back over the purple line and so um, when it is uh, a red coloration here and it crosses back up above that purple line that's going to be a signal to go long when we get a green coloration and it crosses back down below that purple line that's going to be a signal to go short and so let's go ahead and get on with the testing and see what we can get out of this
All right, the first, first signal that we pick up is a short signal. You can see that we have the green coloration right here. Um, and then you can see that we get the cross back down below that purple line right here. And you can see that we make a little bit of a push back to the upside before it then rolls over and makes this push to the downside uh, pretty nicely there. And so that one's definitely going to get us to our take profit. Let's go ahead and continue on. All right, the next signal that we pick up is a short signal and you can see that we made a little bit of a push to the upside here got really close to that 60 percent but not quite enough to hit our take profit before then rolls over makes this push back down here testing this area here and unfortunately it does spike down through that 90 per, or that 90 pip uh, stop there and it is going to stop us out so what I'm going to do now is just go ahead and fast forward through the rest of the testing so that way things will get too long and we will pick this up when we are at the end of the year All right, so that puts us at the end of the testing right there. Before we take a look at what this was able to achieve, if you are looking for a profitable trading strategy, I highly suggest you check out the best strategy that we have tested on the channel here. It was able to achieve an 84% win rate. I'll put a screenshot up of the thumbnail to that video right now. I'll link to it up in the corner and I'll also link to it at the end of this video with that same thumbnail. Like I said, it is a highly profitable trading strategy, was able to achieve an 84% win rate. It uses one of our custom indicators that we've developed here on the channel, as well as a trading view indicator. And all around, it is a wonderful trading strategy. I highly recommend you check that out. And so there is a lot of benefits to becoming a patron of the channel. I highly recommend it. Now, all right, so let's go ahead and take a look at our indicator here. Let's get the scroll back. Now, all right, so let's go ahead and count it out. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. So we have six trades within the one year's time, and we have one, two, and three winning trades. And so unfortunately, it's not going to meet the 60% criteria that we are looking for. Now, with that being said, I do believe that this is actually a pretty decent indicator. Um, if you look at um, kind of just the hold back view here you can see that it did a pretty decent job of catching the tops and the bottoms of most of these really decent moves there were some moments where it did get a little faked out here uh, but for the most part besides this one right here um, all these moves were actually pretty valid moves even the two losing ones here towards the ends and so you can see that this was actually pretty much the bottom of a move we just had a correction pulling back into this area of um, support here before it then bounced off of it again and took off to the upside giving a nice divergence actually right there and then you can see we get almost the same thing right here where this was actually pretty much the end of this little move here before it made a nice move to the downside and you can see that it just bounced back up to this area of um resistance to the upside here and then bounced off of it and made that move to the downside once again giving a pretty decent little 
divergent setup right there. And so you can see <clears throat> that all in all, this indicator was actually a really decent indicator at catching the tops and the bottoms of these moves. And so um, even though this one is technically going to go on the no list, um, I think this one is worth actually exploring more and playing around with maybe incorporating or putting on a side note of um, losing indicators that are still really decent indicators and uh, playing around with it more. So uh, with that being said, though, it is going to go on the no list and we will move on to the next video from here.